With so many political issues like health care, banking reform, and the war having real-life repercussions on the home front, today some school kids got a chance to chew the fat with a Colorado lawmaker. 11 News reporter at Mary Beth Brush is with us now. And Mary Beth, these are issues that we as adults talk about a lot as well. Don and Shannon, from the wars to swine flu, State Representative Kent Lambert spent time today in a Colorado Springs American government classroom and had students talking about some hot topics. A textbook can only go so far when learning about our nation's government. What we're trying to do is to build citizens who have a mind of their own and participate in the political process and help represent themselves. A local politician took time Thursday to give some SEVA charter school students a fresh perspective on how our government works. And like how a bill can pass and to Senate and House. I like talking politics and I'm not really good at talking, but I like to talk about it and be involved and know what's going on. This discussion led by Representative Kent Lambert brought up relevant topics. You know, that's a, a real important issue. Like the H1N1 scare. But does the government have the right to come in, especially if you're talking about nationalized health care, do you have any right of choice as to what your health care is going to be? It's this kind of personal talk that lets students like Jamie Cross feel more comfortable about becoming involved with our government. Many other kids nowadays, we believe that since we are, are younger, um, that we can't talk to representatives and we can't talk to government about how we feel about th certain things when we're the face of the generation, when our kids are going to be, you know, what's going to be going on in the future. And many of the students found themselves now more interested in politics now, they had a, now that they had a chance to speak with a real politician. Don and Shannon. All right, Mary Beth, thank you. Lambert, a Republican, represents House District 14, encompassing northern